Now getting a look at some of the damage Hurricane Dahlia is leaving behind as it moves further inland. Just look at this 85 mile per hour wind gust. This is in Perry, Florida, an hour southeast of Tallahassee. That wind so powerful it blew over a gas station awning. Now, winds aren't the only threat as Adalia tracks across the southeast. Storm surge, still a major concern. First alert meteorologist Courtney Jacobazzi is live in Perry, where that video was taken. Courtney, what are you seeing out there? Right now, thankfully, it's kind of the calm after the storm, after it was just extremely intense earlier this morning as that center of the storm passed right over here behind me. One of the businesses in town severely impacted by those hurricane force winds. The entire front end of this Dollar Tree now in the parking lot. The managers are here to kind of assess the damage and think about what their next steps are. Again, this is just a piece of the damage we've seen. A lot of the roads here impassable because of just all the trees that have fallen down. You might see this motorcade here. Governor Ron DeSantis is actually expected to speak within the next half hour to let the residents here know that they are going to be taken care of. And we did speak to a resident here who is cleaning up her 100 year old home that she rode the storm out in. And she said she's encouraged by how quickly people have been out and about trying to help. I think, you know, we've already started to come together. Everybody's checking on everybody. Um, we've got a great community here, so I think we're all just going to help each other out however long it does take.